Hey, good morning guys. How's everybody doing on this Friday morning? Hey, this is going to be my kickoff video for the uh, buddy build with my good friend Kenny over at Moonwalker Models. And like he showed you on his video, we're going to be building the Cobra 427 in the 1 16th scale. So I have been looking forward to this. Uh, this is a build that Kenny and I have been talking about doing oh, for probably a couple of months now. But then uh, I had my trip to Michigan and of course we all know Kenny had uh, a little interruption up there with Michael coming through. So, but we're finally getting to it. So this is going to be fun. I can't wait to get started on this. And like Kenny had told you in his other video when he got this kit from uh, Colonel Reb, that um, uh, Mike over at Topper Vision did a real good inbox review of it. So, if, but uh, I'm just going to give you a real quick flyby here or flyover of uh, what the parts look like. So, and this has some really nice tires in it. I'm real impressed with these tires. It's got some nice raised letters on the side. Really like these tires. But I'm going to be going with a uh, a green, but it's not going to be the darker green that you normally see on these cars. Um, I'm I'm going to try and darken up the green that I have and see if I can get it a little bit darker but it's probably not going to be the uh, the exact green that you would normally see so like I said this is just a, a quick flyover just to kind of show you the parts it does come with the uh, optional rag top for it but uh, I don't think I'm going to, going to be using that I don't know I just might just be different I don't know probably not though my decals are kind of yellowed so I'm going to be hanging these up in a window I'm going to tape them up in the in the window see if I can't get them to to come back and the interior like I said, I, I'm going to be going with a, a like a pearl green for the body with white stripes and the interior I'm thinking either white or a tan color interior but as you can see here on the uh, the floor here I've got four really big marks that if I tried to sand those out I would lose the the detail of the carpeting so I'm I'm gonna be flocking the uh, floor here and it's also on the door panels the inside door panels that I've noticed there's one here and here and they're they're half over the the carpet and then half over the like the smooth area so the smooth area I can sand that out not a problem and then I'll just I'll just carpet this or you know flock this like I'm like I'm gonna be doing on the floor here and that'll just cover that up won't won't be a problem so but this is a really nice kit and one thing that I really like about it, my yellowed instructions here, but the instructions are all nice 
big illustrations which my old eyes really appreciate <laughs> so and just real quick so I'm gonna be getting started on this one uh, probably tomorrow it's it's all been washed already it's all ready to start painting start gluing and having some fun with this one and then just real quick just give you a, a quick update on the project Caleb here uh, I did some washing on him yesterday and some scrubbing and everything and he's actually cleaning up rather well I was surprised at how well he's cleaning up if you can remember from my last video this little guy was really dirty <laughs> so I still got a couple of spots where I've got to get in with like a q-tip and see if I can get those cleaned out there um, even the, the toothbrush that I've been using to get down into the into all the folds and everything was too big to get in a couple of areas got to get his hand cleaned up a little bit more here but he's he's coming along he, he's getting cleaned up I mean, some of these stains just aren't going to come out and that's fine um, he's a uh, kind of a ceramic type material uh, the bench that he sits on is cement but he's a kind of a ceramic type material so I'm going to be putting a, a primer coat on him and I think that'll take care of the uh, the stains that just won't come off so okay guys that's about it and we'll see you on the on the first update for the Cobra. Alrighty, y'all have a good weekend. I hope you get lots of bench time in, and we'll see y'all on the next video. Bye.